evening, folks. Hey, I'm going to shoot this thing a little early today. It's uh, 20 minutes to 5. I usually do it around 5 o'clock. It's really, really hot here. <laughs> so I stopped early today on the job. I like to get this done because I like going to the bait shop after a while and uh, make some baits. i got to catch up on some new baits that's going to be on the page. Actually, it should be on there tomorrow. Okay? So y'all can check it out. There's some new color crickets coming on. There's three new color crickets coming on tomorrow. All right? I got all that to do on the computer. I got a lot to do with that tonight, too. Plus, edit this video. So I was going to get an early start and just get this done. I'm like 20 minute early start, right? One, two, three hundred. All right? So, let's, here we go. Number 31. Okay, let me get my pad over here. And guys, if y'all think I'm rushing this thing a little bit, I, I have been. The shorter I make this video, the faster I can get it loaded to YouTube. Okay, my, my, I don't have fiber here. Wish we did. Uh, had a discussion with a woman this week about that. That works for the local phone company, and uh, I don't know when this. I don't know when we're gonna have it. They got it close to me. In fact, our our uh, we have a clubhouse here. I said this before. I said this in a video. I don't know if y'all caught it or not. I live in a subdivision that is a golf course subdivision. Okay, and we're waterfront subdivision, and uh, the clubhouse has fiber. Yep, I don't. It takes me forever to load something. All right, numbers thirty one two seventy three. Chuck didn't leave a number. All right. Let me, I think we just talking here. I remember our conversation a little bit. He, he wants me to fish with Richard Gene. You know, Chuck, I appreciate that, but I was like Richard Gene to fish with my baits. Some of y'all watch Richard Gene. Tell him I've got some good baits. Tell him I'll send him some. He can hit me up, email me. And uh, that would help me a lot. That would help my bait company, wouldn't it? You know, I like getting my bait company rolling a little bit better, guys. So, uh, hey, I was painting in the heat there. I said it was hot. I've been painting on a garage, a big, huge garage. And I'm gonna tell you something, guys. It got rough today. Uh, my helper, he'll t I got a summertime helper. He said, "Man, I'm cooking. I'm hot. I'm lightheaded." I said, "I know. It's hot. We quit at uh, we quit about 1:30. Come home, took a shower, and we went up to the Mexican restaurant. Y'all knew that was coming. I know you knew it was coming. <laughs> we went up to the Mexican restaurant and ate lunch. I buy his lunch every day, guys. That's part of the part of him working for me. Every day I buy his lunch. He's just summer help, y'all." Y'all have seen Mason, met him, he's a good kid, and I, I do that for him every every day. I buy his lunch. All right, he wants to eat at Mexican restaurant, wherever he wants to eat, that's where we go. All right, John, number 24. Okay. Let's get John, or John, you're leading right now. John, thank you, you always make nice comments. And guys, a lot of y'all do. I say this, and I know you're somebody going, yeah, 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 and I mean it. Y'all some good guys, you really are. Uh, my channel's growing a little bit. I'm not growing fast. I've seen guys gain 30,000 subs in a couple months. I haven't done that. But I've got good people, and that's the main thing. I've got nice people. John Delady, thank you. He's ordered, I think he's ordered at least twice from me. Guys, if you haven't checked those crickets out, uh, I'm telling you, they're good. Uh, sid has got some of them. He, oh, he likes the tadpole. Uh, the cricket's good, and the tadpole is a sleeper. The tadpole's a good bait. Okay? And here's the thing. Uh, guys, I've got baits you can't buy anywhere else. You, you're not going to buy them, and you're not going to walk into your bait shops and buy I know of, uh, unless somebody there is making them. I mean, they could buy the same molds I've got, right? Okay. But, uh, Sid made a comment that I have colors that you can't find anywhere else. That's what I'm trying to do, Sid. I appreciate that. That's what I'm trying. That's the whole idea. So I'm trying to put colors that you just can't walk in anywhere else and buy. Okay. Number two. John still, John had 24. John's still the closest. Okay. All right, I'm trying not to skip anybody, guys. I'm running my mouth, too, so i got to stop and look every once in a while. <laughs> 171. Uh, guys, I'm at that age. I can't do too many things at one time. 110, 52, 56. Ask my wife. She'll tell me two things, and I told her, she says, you do this one? I said, no, I've done another one. She says, I can only tell you one thing at a time. I'm just getting that age. There's no way I can do it, guys. Gosh, John, I think you got it, buddy. I'm glad to see it. I don't think I don't remember John's ever won or not. Look, it wasn't as many comments this week or many guesses, and the views were down this week. Okay, if guys, if I overlooked you, if I ever overlooked you, and you won, I'm sorry. I will send you baits too. Okay, so make sure. Then as you go through this pretty fast, if I overlook you, to make up for it, I will send you baits too. You cannot go over the number though. That's the only criteria, right? You got to be under the number. And I'm going back to the top. I'm gonna show y'all something real fast. But guys, I do appreciate you. I got some good videos coming out. I just loaded the video on how I make that trough. 
I lost my other trough or the measuring box. You want to call it that? I lost it. It was a. I was traveling fast, guys. I was flying. I was running 40. It's about all my better runs by 42. I was running 39, 40, trying to go up the early in the morning, trying to get to a couple of uh, docks before the traffic got up on the main lake. Somebody was already skiing. I come around a turn. There's the wake. I slowed down. I wasn't going that fast when I hit the wake. I done pulled back on the throttle. But I'm watching ahead. I'm not looking left and right. The thing bounced up in the air. The wind caught it, evidently, and it rolled over the seat and hit the water. I turned on my bike, and it was gone. I couldn't find it. Wouldn't you not think that thing would float? I've been back twice now in that area. I can't find it. And I know the lake, guys. I've been living here 21 years. I went back in the area. I know the area I lost it. Looked around in the grass. I figured we got that water grass. Okay, willow grass. You think it'd wash up in that or something? I, I, I haven't found it. So I, I made a new one. Actually, I made two while I was doing it. I've got an extra one. Um... So that way, y'all can watch the video. I just loaded it this, just a couple minutes ago. I forgot to load it this morning. Guys, I've been going to work early, trying to beat the heat. I got up this morning, made me a sandwich, grabbed a Coke, and out the door. Uh, and, uh, you know, and that's once I get in the truck, good drive, and it's too late. My truck's making a noise this morning. I've got a lot going. Now i got to try to turn off my truck here in a couple minutes. I think it's my power steering pump. But anyway, i got a lot going on, and I can't, I can't keep up with everything. So I'm trying to keep the channel going, trying to keep the baits made. <laughs> Uh, and I love it, guys. I like being busy. Trying to keep the baits made. I got videos to edit tonight. Uh, I got to edit this video too. So uh, I try to. I stay busy, and I enjoy, I like being busy. All right, I have no problem with that. But uh, sometimes I can't get everything done. I want to get done. Y'all ever done that? I, I plan too much some days, and it doesn't happen. All right. I just fell asleep in the chair. I got home, took a shower, went and ate, come back, sit down in the chair, cut the computer on, and I slept for for half an hour. I woke up and went, oh gosh. <laughs> I got a video to edit stuff. Y'all y'all done that. Get my recliner for being in the heat all day, getting in the air conditioning. It just knocked me out. I just next thing I know, I'm gonna sleep. <laughs> so here I am. We're gonna get it done. I'm gonna I'm gonna edit this video now, then I'm gonna go ahead and make some baits, okay? And uh, there's three new colors I said on today. Ice, brim. Brim is a gr green pumpkin color. Okay? And the other one's called ocean. Now guys, you're gonna be surprised when you see it. And I'm gonna tell you, I got a video coming about it. I made a port of catch with it. And I actually filmed myself making it. It's going to have a, it's going to have the filming part in it. And I've caught some nice crappie on that color. And I got a double video coming where I'm using a three-inch bait. It's going to be on the channel later. I caught fish on three-inch bait and the two-inch cricket in the ocean color. Now, I think that's all I'm going to make it in: the cricket, the bug, and this minnow. All right. So I'm trying to do that. So I have some colors in the cricket that's not in the other baits. Is what I'm trying to do, guys. There's a mosquito flying around. How did he get in the house? All right, guys, I'll have to run him down. I don't even meet me alive tonight. Actually, I'm in my basement, so <laughs> he got a long ways to make it upstairs. Maybe I'll catch him before he gets up there. All right, guys, appreciate you. Thanks so much again. Name's Dennis, Fishing Lake Country. Congratulations, John. All right, and uh, I don't even know what's going to be next week. I hadn't even looked ahead that far, but if you remember, Wednesdays, I load a fun video. Fridays, I throw something in there, forgot it. If I got extra videos, I'll throw something in there. If not, Sundays is uh, port of catches or giveaways. I've done quite a few giveaways this time, so I ain't had time to do the port, the port of catch part. Appreciate each and every one of you. Thank y'all so much. Thank each and every one of you that's been visiting the uh, website. Okay, and the comments I'm getting back from people that's buying baits, saying how good a day they had with them, how they're working for them. Coyote fishing. If y'all never watched him. He's got a couple videos that he made but three weeks ago. He said he had the best day of the year he's ever had this year, so far this year using my baits. Caught some big fish, okay? And uh, it's just something different, guys. It's something they haven't seen. You're using colors they haven't seen. That's what it's all about. I catch a lot of fish here, and I have guys pull up on me. Sid made a comment. Got that mosquito that's caught him in my hand. Uh, got rid of him. Uh, so Sid made a comment that he's been having good luck with him on his lake. Uh, and that's what he said. He said, it's, you got colors that the fish ain't used to seeing. So that's that's what it's all about, guys. You're just using something they haven't seen. That tadpole's a different, a whole different critter. It's got a shad body with a willow tail that flops. And the cricket's unbelievable. I, I can't believe that cricket. I just, it, it amazes me when I fish with it, guys. Uh, it's, it's different looking, and the fish like it. I mean, I would never thought that. But I was kind of like, should I buy this more? Well, let's try it. I'm glad I bought that mold. <laughs> I'm telling you. All right, guys. Appreciate you. Hey, we'll see y'all next time. Fishing Lake Country. Mm -hmm.